In the meantime, contrary to the Department of Correctional Services report, which stated that attempts to find Noel Chambers' family in 2004 were unsuccessful, his sister told Radio Jamaica's Beyond the Headlines host, Dion Jackson Miller, recently that she visited her brother regularly. I remember in 2004, they came at my home and they, somebody from down the correctional center came to me and they asked me if he should come home, where would he be going? I said he would be going to the country to live with his sister, who is now sick, but the house is there with him, so he would have somewhere to go. I always visit him because his visiting was like two times per month. And in response to the minister's statement, opposition spokesman on national security, Fitz Jackson, says the family of Noel Chambers must be compensated by the state. He said he visited the family earlier today. One of the pain that his family is feeling now, they do not know the cause of death. That's what was told to us this morning. They don't know the cause of death. I don't know where the breakdown in communication may have taken place. But having heard you said what the cause of death was, Minister, I think before, by tomorrow we have contact with the family for them to at least... In fact, when she was speaking about not knowing the cause of death, she actually broke down in tears. Her brother died and she don't even know what he died from.